Mandir is one of the most significant and holy spaces in one's apartment. Today, we'll be talking about just that and I'll share my design process. If you're new here, I'm Kavita and you're watching The Kalai. Let's get started. The space that we allocated on site for the mandir is a small nook in the corner of the living room. Hence, before starting the designing part of it, we need to keep in mind the entire look and feel of the living room as the mandir is only going to be a part of it. The first and foremost thing that we do when designing any space is ask the client what they want and how they envision the space. Our client wanted a simple and bright mandir. They wanted the space to be well lit and ergonomic as they wanted to offer their prayers standing. On site we had the sill at 18 inches and since our clients wanted to pray while standing we had to raise the height. So we decided to add some drawers, utilize that space and then lay on top of that the platform for the mandir. We decided to go for a double door instead of a single one because the space was just wider than the standard size. This area in particular doesn't get enough light and we had to ensure that this space was well lit. So we decided to illuminate the space from the inside in the ceiling by running lights in all four sides and also add two parallel lights just beside the door. Inspiration while designing can literally come from the objects that surround you. You just need to be creative enough and use that objects and blend it into your space. When designing any space, we need to have a basic understanding of the nature of the space itself. In the case of a mandir, we have to be aware that people generally prefer two materials, either wood or marble. And of course, we decided to use both. The panelling was done in wooden laminate finish and for the walls and platforms of the mandir, we used the G4 nano white marble. A mandir's door is usually designed as such that the air and light can pass in and out. So we used a laser cut mild steel grill which is also known as MS grill in an antique or gold finish if you will and we decided to put this grill on the ceiling of the mandir as well. I would love to hear your thoughts in the comments down below and please don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you so much for your time.